Hello friends, welcome to my channel Technical Arco and myself Arnab Kundu. Today I will discuss the Java program in BlueJ environment. Means how to write Java programs in BlueJ environment, how to compile it and how to run the program. Okay, so go to the computer screen. Hello friends, welcome to my channel Technical Arco and myself Arnab Kundu. Today I will discuss two different problem in Java using Blue J ID. The first problem is that to take a number as input and find out the summation of the digits of that number. Okay. And the second problem is that to take a number as input and find out reverts of that number as output. Okay. Here I am using Blue J version 4.1.4. .4, okay. So, go to the Blue J ID. Okay. So, friends, this is the Blue J ID. And now I do at first the first problem, then do the next problem. Okay. So, at first click on new class. And at first the problem is that we take a number as input and it will print some of the digits of that number as output. Okay. So, that's why I just put the name of that class sum underscore of digits okay and press okay so this is the class file and just open the editor and just delete whatever written by default and just write the class name class sum underscore of underscore digits okay and within that at first we write our method public static void main and send as argument string args means string array. Now we take some variable and we take the variables integer variable. Okay. So int n comma d comma s and put the value of s by default 0. Okay. Means s initialize its value at 0. Now this is an input means the problem take inputs that's why we write system dot out dot println and just write enter the number okay and after end this double quote close this parenthesis now we take the input so to take input we need here some input taken class and the class is scanner. So to use this scanner class, we need to import some package. So just write import java dot util dot scanner. Okay. Means the util package contain the scanner class. Okay. So after what we write scanner sc means we create the object of that class. Just write new scanner and send as argument system dot in and close this parenthesis okay after what we take the input in form of integer so just write n equal and just write sc dot next int okay and close this parenthesis means input it just convert into integer format okay now we use the logic how to sum of the digits whatever the number we entered as input okay so that's why we are using a while loop and check n not equal 0 and here we write d equal n percent 10 means every time we just find out or extract the remainder part of that number whatever we take as input okay and after we sum after that s equal to s plus d because default value of s we take as 0 and after we just write n equal to n by 10 means then we take the quotient for the next iteration. Okay. Then we close this while loop we should print the result so that is why we write system dot out dot print ln and just write within double quote sum of the digits close this double quote and write plus s means we just concatenate 
after we close our main method and then we close our class sum of digits okay so now we compile that so there is no error just close it and after right click on that and run void main and now we just enter here as input suppose we send as input 1 to 4 so output should be 1 plus 2 plus 4 7 so press enter so sum the digits 7 okay now again check just right click on that again click on void main and suppose we send us input 551 so what will be the output 11 5 plus 5 plus 1 will be 11 so some of the results will be 11. clear now we go for the another example or another problem now we take input and it will print reverse of that number what does it mean suppose we send us input 1 2 3 it will print 3 2 1 suppose we enter a input 112 so it will print 211 just reverse of that number okay same way click new plus and suppose we put the class name reverse underscore of number okay and press okay so this is the class file just open editor delete everything whatever written into there now we write our class class reverse underscore of underscore number and now we write our main method public static void main send as argument string array string address and second bracket open means brace open and same way we write some integer int n comma d comma s equal to 0 actually the previous problem just some modification into there and then we get the reverse of that number actually means previous problem will be the same for that problem also we change just little more here okay same way we just take input just write write system dot out dot println and just write here enter the number close this double quote and close this parenthesis and after what we should take input so that's why we import java dot util dot scanner class okay now we write here scanner s equal to new scanner and send as argument system dot in same way just write n equal to sc dot next in so next in method just take the input and convert into integer okay and same way we put the logic here while n not equal to 0 and now here the first line will be the same as the previous problem is concerned d equal to n percent 10 means every time we extract the each and every digits and it will take from the last digit is concerned suppose 1 2 3 it will extract the 3 at first then 2 then 1 okay now what happened just write s equal to now we just change here 10 asterisk s plus d this is the change the last problem is that s equal to s plus d now we just multiplied by 10 because we know whatever the number we send as input or daily life whatever we are talking in the number is concerned they are the decimal number so if we just multiply each and every disease so the digits will be just shifted from right to left okay and after we just write n equal to n divided 10 okay after what close this while and now we just print the result system dot out dot println and just write reverse number is close this double quote sorry there will be out okay and now after we just write plus s means we just concatenate then close this main method and then close our class reverse of number okay 
compile it there is no error so close this editor and then just click on void main and now same way enter the number suppose we send as one two three and press enter the reverse number is three two one yes again check right click on that run it send the input suppose seven zero three yes the reverse number is three zero seven okay i hope you have understood today's topic there is a two problem i have discussed today one is the summation of the digits whatever we take as input and another whatever the input we are provide just print the reverse if the input is 1 2 3 it will print 3 2 1 okay i hope that you have understood today's topic for more videos keep watching my channel technical arquen thank you and bye bye